Yo, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Super with the Burning BDP Gas Day, and welcome to my channel. Do all the things the algorithm likes, and hope you all feeling good, good, smelling good, and in good health. As we sit here and play more Last of Us 2, Last of Us 2, Last of Us Part 1 here on PC. Um, my first time ever playing Last of Us. In, in general, my first time ever, like, really diving into the Last of Us universe. Alright, so I think we're on our own when it comes to the current situation. Take that guy out. Get a little peeky peeky. Ooh, child. Go around this way. Maybe our odds see better. Wait, pounce. You're a wall ammo? I know the game seems like the flashlight isn't seen by the enemy, but uh, it's like second nature to my brain to turn off the light whenever um, enemies are near and you know, stealthy situations. Especially if you play games like like I play. You know, the example I give is the Metro games. In Metro, you have your light on when you're trying to like hide. The enemies will be notified. Come on. Yeah, that was a situation where our aim was just bad. All right, come on down. Uh, that's happens when you, you take risks. We should have been more patient when it came to that person instead of just assuming that I can just go and attack. Let's just get out of here. You're impressed. I missed a lot of shots. Like I definitely need to turn my sensitivity down a little bit. Sensitivity is like definitely a little too high. In my mouth right now. Where are we going? Yeah, we turn our sensei down a little bit. Yeah, I attribute my missing shots to that and anything else. Find my sensei is just a, a little high. Yeah, today for episode three, we're trying um, low settings with cam on and see right, if things stay good. All right, hold on. Last video, we tried to have cam on with OBS instead of Streamlabs. And, uh, you know, it will go in and out when it comes to is, is, um, what you call it? Like the, the, the skipping. Yeah. What I feel like is, is most just VRAM. I don't have enough VRAM to run game at a higher sudden and record at the same time like i can run the game at high i'm just like naturally Here, playing the game and not recording at the same time but you know via having uh you know the the, the, the software for like obs the stream labs whatever um 
it has extra Down things being hill. used up. You get through here. Watch your back. And again, I know for a lot of y'all, your head is immediately just like, well, just get a new this or get a new that. I don't really have the phones for it. Yeah. When you're a content creator who's pretty much not really growing, feel like you're doing all the right things in terms of people, people like your content, so they say, um, you're uploading on a consistent basis, things like that. But you're not really growing. And you always brush me off. It's gonna be kind of hard to like get that content creator revenue. You don't have the content creator growth. Like a lot of other content creators, they can they have pay pigs and whatnot who, who assist them in being able to like have the, the best things. They got sponsors who can assist them and make sure they have the best things. You know, AMD sponsorships, things like that. Yeah, and this isn't like a, a me ranting about you know anything envious or, or jealous or anything like that. I understand. But what I'm saying is for like people who view my content, for example, for like y'all to like not be like just do this or just do that. You know, that's not necessarily an easy thing to be done for me. Just, you know, go buy a new PC or you know, get a second PC. That would be like the recording on the PC and then just be the game PC, you know, go get a at least a 30 series card or things like that. Yeah, if I could do it, I would gladly do those things. You know, if money wasn't like a, a factor, Tess, I would get the best here. of the best for y'all. Not for me, because I'm fine. I can play this game just like this and be great, be entertained, and, and love every second of it. But for y'all, the viewer, um,. I 100% want to provide you guys with the best quality content that can be done. Look at his sleeve. Firefly. Yep. These guys aren't doing well in or out of the city. I just hope there's someone alive to meet us at the drop off. Meet up the second Firefly team in Capitol Building. Capitol Gold Dome, girl 5314, red hair. And uh, again, we keep forgetting that this game once you hit, hit basically the back button to get out of things instead of escape. Usually, escape is fine. Yeah, but again, I don't want that to be like be taken as like. Uh, and ask for help or you know me being envious of other content creators things like that like that i'm having fun i'm enjoying the content that i put out and i hope you guys enjoy it too now quite honestly if i do you know achieve what i want to achieve and, and as a content creator which is basically just um you know, being a, a game journalist and things like that And I'm happy. You know, that's like my lifelong goal is to be a game journalist. And if I can do that and provide you guys with, with content, I'm happy. We need more. Can we make it another shift? Here we go. Let's see if we can find some more material for shifts. And apologies, people who don't want to hear like that kind of stuff <laughs> in the middle of a, a let's play. The reason why I say it because I, I I do like always think about the fact that if I have someone who's like 
was gonna like hear me say why I'm running things that the way I run things but, like just you can just do this because a lot of people on PC are, are insecure not insecure but like inconsiderate and just assume that anyone who's a content creator can just go get new shit I've had that movies more I've had live streams where like a viewer had came to my stream and was like hey can you play this game it was like a Nintendo game and I was like I don't own a switch and he's like, can you, can you go, can you go buy one? And it's like this person is thinking to himself that I can just get my black ass out of my chair in the middle of, middle of a live stream and go buy a Nintendo Switch. And I'm like, I can't really just go buy a Switch. And he's like, but you're, you're a streamer, you can afford to get one. And I asked what his, what his age was. He said he's like freaking 14 or 15 years old. It was like, I understood at that point where it's like, this fucker doesn't know better. See what think every if someone's a content creator, they got they got the funds to buy shit. Every content creator is freaking loaded. easy yeah so i didn't like i didn't like ban or anything like that or get mad because once i understand that someone's a, a child i mean anyone under the age of 20 is, is a kid um once i understood that this was, was, was a kid you know 14 years old i was like yeah i'm not gonna like get annoyed that this that, that this kid doesn't understand life he doesn't understand that not everybody who's content creator is, is you know riding around in, in, in bins and Shit. I think I've heard about this scene. Is this a train? Again, thinking of the Trevor Noah freaking special. He said something about like a like a, a twenty minute long train situation. We're at a point right now we don't have any shivs, so instead of going for the kill, we're basically trying to like just sneak past them. Yeah, I didn't know what to do with that guy. She can spot people. She shows her to spot anybody at all. Yeah, there's a guy in that room. The angle that he's in isn't really an angle that I can like stealth attack him. So they just leaving that left that room and just not even gonna pay any attention. Yeah. At the same goes when it comes to trying to be stealthy. Sometimes it's better to just not even like bother with an enemy. Trying to see if this one's gonna freaking do. Then they're throwing a bottle to make him go into that corner. Investigate that. I'm, I've gotten so used to them not having things on them that I almost didn't grab that ammo. I'm glad this game has selective hearing. Hey. Come on. 
Hurry up. Yeah, there's a Trevor Noah bit. I think I was talking about before I was interrupted. Um, where he's like, there's it's like a, a train tunnel scene that lasts like, that took him like 20 minutes or some shit. And this show apparently just doesn't even freaking bother with that scene at, at, at all. Holy shit. We actually made it. Everyone okay? Yes. Let's move. He made it sound like it was like really hard and complicated. It's not very hard and complicated. It's just more along the lines of you know not over again. That's someone who plays games like Metro, State of Decay, you know Tomb Raider, like a lot of post apocalyptic okay. video games or games that are set in, in a where you, you might need to be stealthy a, a good going, bit. Uh, it's more just picking your battles than anything else. Capital buildings in this direction. Like right now, this is me picking my battles. Over this truck. Let's see what we can find. <laughs> yeah, that's all that, that scene is. Just picking your battles. I I chose right right here to to engage these guys because once he was in his room or it's like in that scene you know if you're just being patient and like i didn't even use the freaking little cute things where you can see people you don't need to really use it just be patient those look more like the ones that bit me they still have their faces they're recently infected those soldiers must have just turned which means there's more in the area we gotta go Ironically, that wasn't on purpose in terms of like, you know, me knowing that we had to like go into this thing. Um, I thought we were just gonna be able to like get around all across the thing. I came in here to throw this like, like some good loot in there. And I was like, oh, there's like three dudes in here and missions like somewhere else. Yeah, you know, be a good time to like just get some, some good loot potentially. Using some gate some video games, you wouldn't have some, a dangerous area, and then the player can choose to risk their life to get you know some decent um, things at the price of you know taking that risk. So far, so good. We haven't really got any dips that I've noticed. So maybe putting the game on low settings and having less you know. Help, not less, but help with the VRAM. Now our VRAM is in a positive instead of being in the, in the yellow. On your shoe. Huh. Gross. It's pretty funny. You know what that remind me of? Okay. I, I know I, I keep mentioning references, but that feels like a Sean. Like it's not from Sean the Dead, but it feels like like something that you would see in Sean the Dead. Like Sean the Dead has like a, a joke where it's like you got red on you, and if someone has like you know certain things on them, be it blood or, or ink. Well, how were you bitten? I mean, you must have been somewhere you shouldn't to find an infected in the zone. Yeah. I, this has more damage. I kind of like the, the handgun a little more. Sneak out. You know, what are some changes we can make to it? Low speed, capacity, and fire rate. That place is completely off limits. How the hell did you get in there? Sure. I had my ways. Anyways, one of those, what you guys call runners, bit me. And that was that. I see. Capacity. So with that as well. And that's pretty much all we would do for now. No. I went to her for help afterwards. Yeah. Knowing I feel like that's like a, a Shaun of the Dead level of like, you know, I don't want to say deadpan humor, but kind of deadpan humor where it's just like, 
you know, it's just small skill. Kind of chuckle laugh. That should help us out. Anything over here, ladies? I would have like a lot of good supplies, but you know, this game does take 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 place twenty years after um the whole situation happened. So a lot of these places are freaking already freaking ransacked and dealt with. We got two doors bust in here. We get to another door. What does this door lead to? So that kind of leads to what looks like where, where you gotta go. And this door leads to an alternate route to the same spot. That doesn't seem necessary. My vase seems so out of place in um this little area. Well, that's why it was sorry get close to me a scripted moment what is this place it's an old museum some of these things are hundreds of years old really? wow. yeah, let me just take that fucking sword like, I don't know about y'all, but I definitely would just, like, we're in a, a place that has a sword. That would be very helpful, both stealth-wise and just what they need to do dealing with. But the game plot says otherwise. All right, watch your head. All right, go, go, go. I'm alive. Oh. I'll make my way around. Look, they're here! Tess? Run! Run! Run? Run where? We don't have any shivs. Oh, should have grabbed that brick. Might come in handy. You know what really sells these clickers? The random freaking like collars that they do. That's unfortunate. You can actually get through here. I think they heard the thunder. Yeah, what sells them a little bit is they'll randomly fucking shout and that makes you freaking like stop the turn around and see if they heard you. Because usually if you hear like a loud sound, you feel like you, you alerted them. It's a good thing that they this game added. Or has, I should, I should say not added. Like the fact that they'll just randomly make freaking a loud sound as if they're being, being alerted. It makes you the player again. Part of what makes it a good pop of the video game is that 
By that, I mean like anxiety. Anything that can give you anxiety, anything that can make you feel or of any kind of sense is good in a post part of the video game, movie, or TV show. I feel like no matter how many times you play that game, them making a, a louder sound will always get you freaking feel like. Get me weather, bitch. Fucking John Jones in this bitch. Switch my gun. It's when I thought I hit the button to switch. God damn it, dude. You gotta do so many weird, like, shits to just switch. Like, why don't, why don't he has, like, cargo pants on? Why do you have to go into your backpack to get it to a separate gun? Just pull. Runs through the fucking fire. We shot that man's hat off, but couldn't freaking like get a headshot. That was too damn close. Yeah, like I, it's not too slow to, to switch, but like it just seems really inconvenient and silly that you have two freaking like handguns essentially and you put one in your boot bag like look how many pockets joel has you can put like he can have one of his I mean, where his ass cheek is right now and then have one up front like i don't it doesn't make to me logical sense that he puts away one of the handguns In terms of like putting into his backpack to where if you need to switch your to, to like your other gun, you gotta go into your backpack and that'll freaking Tess, conflict with freaking you with your handgun. Are you? You didn't do shit. This will get us to the roof. Kid. What about you, Kate? You okay? It's a fine okay. Are you still breathing? Do you still panic breast count? Yeah, they can. Right. I'm okay. Yeah, I'm sure I'm gonna notice like a lot of design choices like that as I play the game that might irk me. Again, I always say that your experience with other games can, can dictate how you feel towards any other game that you play because you always compare it to like those other games. You always compare it to the games you've played that have similar freaking like styles and aesthetics and whatnot. Stand back. There she is. That's our building. What are we trying to like, get across here? All right. Now watch your step as you're going up, because it's going to be a little. So she's perfectly fine with like this height, but not not the the, the scalping that Jet were on there before. That's called inconsistent game. Is she okay with heights or not okay with heights? That everything you hope for. Jury's still out. But man, can't deny that view. Come on, this way. Hey, let's pick it up. We're almost done. Stay focused. Yes, ma'am.
It's right around this corner. Come on. Let's keep moving, kid. I mean, we're standing still and she's moving, so... Take your own advice. One of the other like illogical things in this game that I've noticed is this right here that this guy can just move things like this by himself. Like he doesn't move it in a way like where it's like it seems heavy. He freaking throws this thing around. He could like move things that seem heavy around like it's nothing. But then we like struggle up with other things. There we go. Ohm stretch, Tess. That's you can loot cars and pop the trunk to see if there's anything in them. Um, just so it's out there, I can't swim. Look, it looks like it's shallow on the right side. Follow me. She's on the left. I'm glad Marlene hired you guys. What do you mean? I know you guys are getting paid for this, but... I'm gonna watch her. She I said the see. right side. I want to see her go lean to the right. Safety's all. No. No, no, no. What happens now? What are you doing, Tess? Oh, God. Maybe they, uh, maybe they had a map or uh, something to tell us where they were going. How far are we going to take as this? As far as it needs to go. Where was this lab of theirs? She never said. She only mentioned that it was someplace out west. What are we doing here? This is not us. What do you know about us? About me? I know that you are smarter than this. Really? Guess what? We're shitty people, Joel. It's been that way for a long time. No, we are survivors. This is our chance. It is over, Tess! Now, we tried. Let's just go home. I'm not... I'm not going anywhere. This is my last stop. What? Our luck had to run out sooner or later. Are you going on? No, don't! Don't touch me. Holy shit. She's infected. <laughs> Joel. Let me see. I didn't mean for you. Show it to me. Oh, Christ. Oh. Oops, right? Give me your arm. This was three weeks. I was bitten an hour ago, and it's already worse. This is fucking real, Joel. You've got to get this girl to Tommy's. He used to run with this crew. He'll know where to go. No, no, no. no. That was your crusade. I am not doing that. Yes, you are. Look. There's enough here that you have to feel some sort of obligation to me, so you get her to Tommy's. They're here. Damn it. I can buy you some time, but you have to run. You want us to just leave you here? Yes. There is no way that... I will not turn into one of those things. Come on. Uh. Make this easy for me. No, no, just go! Just fucking go. Yeah, was Joel fucking her? Ellie. I'm sorry, I didn't, I didn't mean for this. I feel like there's like a ro romantic tension between these two. Did you have a map? How do you know they're in there? Or was that Fuck. 
sheet that we found I we did that. It was from a soldier. I don't remember if it was from a soldier or from like what you call him. Stop. Still she's already dead. She got bit, remember? Let's see what we can find. I also kind of feel like the computer control people are, are a little useless. Maybe that changes as the game goes on. I feel like that chick really didn't help me out at all. I feel like we got to that, that fight where I end up throwing a freaking Molotov. It feels like um, they just kept charging towards towards me and she was relevant. Take out the door. You. Oh my god. Yes, sir. Tess. I mean, we knew she was going to die. I knew she was going to die. I mean, she got bit, so. They're going to be here soon. Yeah. I want to explore, but I feel like there's probably like, nothing actually around here. At least nothing that would be like massive to me to have. Well, for me to have, just like not to me. But over here, this guy looks like he has a, a, a rifle or shoddy. Isn't she a rifle? Yes, yeah, a rifle. A little bit of a hunting rifle, some bolt action action. One out of five shots. All right, so there is a quick swap option, so you don't have to always go to your your backpack to freaking force shit out. Joel, I got this. Relax, kid. All right, it doesn't look like we want to be able to like sneak our way through here. Maybe we can. You'll see. Be a little patient see what happens and that guy is like he is ready he got to the north he is fucking ready it would be ideal if this guy comes to my right if he doesn't know that's still fine <laughs> Just any way where we, he's out of the line of sight, the guy in the middle. Alright, so we'll make our way inside to the left. I don't think that one guy is ever going to move. We're fine. This is why I said I don't think like the, the whole whole queue to like be able to like see through walls and stuff isn't necessary. I hope that, that that's a, a little hand holding that isn't necessary. Yeah, a situation where it's just timing. It's fine. The guy didn't fire a single shot, didn't drop any ammo. Logic there is what I'm questioning. Yeah, that was all just timing. Maybe someone like, well, if you use your Q right there. All right, I'm just gonna fuck this guy up. Come on, yes, I'm like, if you use your cure there, you saw that guy. Like, I'm, again, it, just, it, makes it makes it too easy. The risk of getting caught is actually like a pretty decent thing. You don't want to have like the risk of being caught lessened by an ability that, that allows you to slow down time and, and see through walls. You know, it's basically like a, 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 an easy escape out. What are we doing? Joel, how are we going to get out of here? Right, right. We're going to go 
after that all. Stay down. I don't know how many more there are. A good bit by the looks of it. So we can see. Yeah, see, like you just use your your natural peripheral vision to to, to do with what that ability allows you to do. Back up, kid. Report. South clear. North clear. No target. I don't know what that second guy is going to do. Seems like three people pushed that same door. See so if we can get like a little peek around. So just use Pearl Vision to freaking look and not make the game easier myself. I still haven't found the last two. I heard one of them was a kid. Doesn't matter. They took out a bunch of our guys. Jesus. Well, hey, after today, this whole Firefly bullshit will be behind us. Amen to that, brother. Yeah, we're not in a good position. Joel, there's the exit. He's out of ammo. Why did my ammo. damn it game? Like, why did it default back to the freaking handgun? I had the freaking rifle out. This is rough. Wasn't the cleanest way to go about things, but we were in a bad situation. I'll take shooting and do sheiks. Yeah, that was sloppy, but we got caught in a, a pretty bad situation where we were between guys who were like peeking at, around the exact same time. And then we didn't have any ammo and the gun that the, that the game automatically put on me because I had my rifle out, but I guess the game defaults you to a handgun after you do a stealth, a stealth attack. We should... I don't have any crafting. We should still have one though. We can heal ourselves. So. No, we don't. That's fine. We'll we'll make do. <laughs> Stay low. The only downside to being low on health is just the, the, the visuals of it. How would they even know that the tunnels where we went? Time to put the freaking mask on. Or they just miss it, and and the, the frantic of running from a freaking mounted machine gun. Patience is going to have to like be our, our best friend here. Instead of when we're, we're low on health.
Good thing that guy didn't freaking peek this way. It takes a long time for you to do like those stealth takedowns. So if he would have looked to his right when I was doing that, it would have been enough time for him to see. I do want him to like see the, the body. That way we can take him out too. My cousin just got on Last of Us. I saw like the Steam notification. Y'all can't see if my camera's blocking it. Come on, just 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 keep 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 it coming. Don't be don't be scared. I'm waiting for you. So are my viewers. No offense. Neither of them dropped anything. Not no bullets, no nothing. Take a peek on this, on this train. Maybe you see something on here. No. You think the game wants to go that way? If it does, let's. I don't feel like I, I I don't I don't know what the like if this game is a game that has like that kind of free flow to where I can go down there and, and explore, see what I can find, or if like this way is where we is is the, the explore and going down to the thing is just um yeah well that it gives us our, our answer because we can't climb that. Yeah, what I'm trying to say is I don't know how open world this game is. I'd imagine it's not very open world. It's like, a, you can just go wherever the fuck you want. If it looks like somewhere you can go, you can go. Hey, uh, I can't swim. We'll figure something out. Will we? Can I not go through here? We can dive. Uh oh. That's someone who's never worn a gas mask before. Gas mask. You know, like, sometimes you can, you can have water just on in this way like you, you die in a gas mask and be fucking fine the entirety of this all right so the question now becomes You're not gonna leave me here, right? no Just stay put it's imagine you can probably dive underneath this the fact that she said you're not gonna leave me down here implies to me that this is like just a, a area to explore for you to find some things okay guess we're not getting that our breath oh we got everything we need to get from there anything down there 
It's a dead end. Well, it's a ladder. Maybe we can use that. They get up there. You don't have the upper body strength to pull yourself up there. Maybe we can like have her get on this platform. I'm thinking about putting this sort of thing in, in myself, climbing on it. But maybe the game prefer. Yeah. Really? Really? My guess is right. Uh, Careful, I child. Know. I got you. I feel like he can easily just climb onto the freaking thing, unless it's just, you know, a weight problem. You wanna... Are you good? Let's see what's down here first, and then we'll make our way. Alright, there's nothing down here. Well, since so now I'm there, I guess now is our exit, which at that point, that's it for today's video. Thank you all for watching. Hope you all enjoyed uh, episode three of my last was Let's Play. Seems like we can do cam with low settings, so we'll, we'll do that. You know, the game's still great to look at, so it's not like it's a, a, a big deal. Hope you all are enjoying these Let's Plays. Hope you all enjoy today's video. Do all these algorithm likes, like the video, comment, subscribe, follow me on Twitch. Thank you for watching below. I've been Boy and Nubus. Y'all stay safe. Be kind to one another this weekend. Hope you have a good weekend. If it's not the weekend, Hope you had a good weekend. So, I don't, I don't know when this video is gonna go. Up. I know episode one is gonna go up on Wednesday, the 29th. But everything else, I don't know after that. But you know, we're, we're rambling. Thank you all for watching. I'll be your boy. I'm out of here. I'm gonna get to take a, a, a good old nappy nap. Is this?